Hi guys, today I want to talk to you a little bit about step up and step down rings. Um, we have um, them here, they're DC162, you can get them on Amazon, eBay, that sort of thing. And these will allow you to attach any number of different um, filters to the lenses which you're using. Um, I'll, I'll go with the step down rings first because I've got them in order. It goes down from 82 millimeters to 77, 77 to 72, 72 to 67, 67 to 62, 62 to 55, 55 to 52, 52 to 43, 43 to 37, 37 to 30, 30 uh, to 26. And in reverse, it's the same. So 26 to 30, 30 to 37 and so on. Um, but they allow me to do a lot of um, cool things. Um, I'll show you uh, an example right now actually. Um, my camera, the camera lens which I've got on at the moment is uh, my Lumix GX lens and uh, that is a 37 diameter I believe and um, I'm going to attach the Marumi star filter to it um, which is a 62 millimeter diameter so I'm going to um, go all the way up to 62 and attach the camera lens so um, we can see the candle there we go and through the star filter it will look ever so slightly different I'll just um, attach it on there we go and we'll put you on there come on don't bite me yeah, it, it doesn't seem to want to exactly go. Is it really 37? Yeah, it is 37. This should work then. It's usually very good. There we go. And instantly we have a star, which is really good. Now, I'm going to try this out with a couple of other ones, and I'm going to talk during the clips so that you can see exactly what I'm doing, that sort of thing. Okay, shooting out of an open window in my bedroom, I am now going to proceed to attach an ultraviolet filter to the lens to try and cut haze out of the Atmos. So there we go. And there we have it. A slightly clearer shot. And we can just sort of zoom around a little bit. I think that's really nice actually. And finally on to the real reason as to why I got uh, the step up and step down rings. I like using the Canon 50mm uh, Prime, the um, 1.8 stop um, lens. I believe there's a 1.2 stop as well, so I was just mentioning that so uh, not to be confused. Uh, but I wanted to use my Marumi star filter on that exact lens and I love the depth of field in this thing which is absolutely beautiful. Um, so basically I'm going to use it to attach this so here's the uh, flame normally and I'll just add the filtering gone yeah it, it takes a bit of time and it's not helping that the filter is literally uh, it turns around as well but there you have it you can get absolutely beautiful effects using um, this sort of thing so I think that it is an absolutely um, an absolute bargain for the price which it is, which is usually about 14 to 20 pounds. But this is just a quick example of how you can use uh, a filter on um, these different these different uh, lenses, which uh, allows you to uh, basically just have one set of filters and not have to worry about things. Of course, there are some lenses, well, some lenses which don't fit into the filter settings so be very very careful when you're ordering a set of these that you're ordering them for the right um, size up and size down because otherwise you're um, not getting the best benefit out of um, out of these that you could be getting if you like this video in any way yeah please feel free to subscribe like rate um, if you didn't like it press the dislike button leave comments in the thing below and uh, maybe spread it and show it to people um, I hope it's been helpful uh, and take care. Bye.